Pilar's school opens. Okay, children. Take your healthy diet. And now, already I have started the fourth lesson about eating healthy with Gurudha. Okay. So, regarding that lesson, we are going to continue. So, already I told you the four paragraphs regarding that lesson. Three paragraphs. So, in that lesson, we came to know that Gunduram is a small young boy and he loved to eat lots of food. Always he loves eating, eating, eating. There is no end for his greediness. Okay, and what type of food he used to take? He used to take french fries, chocolates, samosas. And the ice creams, cutlets, all these unhealthy food, which is delicious, but this food is unhealthy. Okay, children? This type of food he used to often eat. Whenever you see, he used to do on munching, means going on eating. Whenever, whatever the time you, you see, you can find he often eats the food. He used to go on munching. So, because of eating this unhealthy food, day by day he became sluggish. Sluggish means laziness or slow. Okay? And because, and this took place just because his body has weight has been increased. That means he became obese. He became obese. This is what the reason. Because of being obese and because of being uh, sluggish, he be, his stamina became low. Okay? His stamina means energy to do any part of work. His stamina started being reducing. And that is even been observed by the teachers also. Now let us come to the next part of this lesson. Then one day, after a boring and sluggish morning, spent at home, munching on chips and playing video games, his mother forced him to go outside and walk in the fields. So, one day, mother was also observing the same thing. Every day, this Gunduram is coming from school, sitting at one place, going on munching, munching, munching. Means, eating different, different types of fast foods. And not doing any part of the work, not moving from his place, not even moving from his place. So mother felt irritating. Mother also was not satisfied. This boy was always taking the chips. He was going on munching the chips. No, only or else playing the video games. You know, playing video games, no need to move from your place, isn't it? We can sit at one place using your mobiles, you can play in the mobiles some games or through the video games we can play the games and his mother forced him to go outside and walk in the field so very forcefully his mother on that day she asked her to be out of the room and go for a walk in the fields you know that his house is surrounded with a beautiful garden which is which looks like a beautiful big fields okay children so she forcefully sent him outside the house and she asked him to go for a walk. You know very well why do we do a walking? If we do walking, our energy levels, our stamina <coughs> will increase as well as our obesity. Because of walking, lot of calories will burn. Lot of calories will burn. And that transforms into sweat and comes out of your body. And this happens means automatically your obesity will decrease. And you know very well, most of the people early in the morning go for a walking in the fresh air, in the parks, in the open grounds, playgrounds, these type of grounds they will select and they will go for a walk, isn't it? And some uh, early in the morning, some will do uh, tennis playing, tennis, cricket, different, different type of activities they will do and they will reduce their obesity. Okay, children? Now, you must get some fresh air and exercise, Gundu. She said, adding, your teacher say you are very lethargic. Your teacher says that you are very lethargic. What do you mean by lethargic? Nothing but lethargic means it is also like related to the Stamina, lacking of energy, lacking of energy and enthusiasm, enthusiasm, lacking of energy and enthusiasm. Here, what his mother said is, go and get some fresh air. If you go outside the fields, in our surrounding gardens, if you go out, 
you will get some fresh air. If you do exercise, your body will start working. And uh, she also added like this. Means she also said not only doing walking and uh, not only doing the exercise. She also asked it to. She also said like this. Your teachers always say that you are nowadays you are becoming so lethargic. Your teachers are giving a complaint to me that you have become so lethargic. What do you mean by lethargic? Ma? Lacking of energy and enthusiasm. <coughs> Enthusiastic means wanting to know. Uh, we have a wish to know something more and more. We have a wish to know something more and more. That gene is not present in your child now. Nowadays he is so uh, he is not at all using his energy. He is so lethargic means he is not showing any interest. Enthusiasm is interest also you can say. He is not showing any interest regarding the works or anything. Not doing a proper uh, listening skills are also day by day decreasing. Hurt and angry. He escaped into the fields and sat there sulking. Suddenly before him stood a radiant lady. She was let me write radiant. <coughs> radiant means nothing but glowing. Glows brightly. Some children uh, when you put a watch which is dark during the night time it will be shiny, green in color. So that is called as radiant glow. Radiant glow. Some balls will be there. Uh, rubber balls. When we play, when we push the ball like this, a radium light will come out. Radium, it, it glows out. That is called as radiant. Okay? Some glowing brightness. So, listening to his mother's words, because your teachers are also complaining always, they are giving a complaint that you are becoming low, day by day you are become lesser chip. Now, all this listening to him, listening to her mother, immediately he felt God. He was very hurt and he got angry and he moved outside the fields. He went outside the fields. But did he do the walking or not? No, he didn't do. He just sat somewhere. He just sat somewhere. Suddenly before him stood a radiant lady. Radiant means a brightening lady was stood in front of him. She was green in color and wore clothes and jewels made of vegetables and fruits. Yeah, here you can see the picture if you want to see. Here you can see the entire body she has covered with the green clothes and her body is covered with as jewels. She wore grapes as uh, ornament, neck ornament, she wore orange fruits like this. The entire body she wore and you can see on the top of their head like a crown, she kept tomatoes. You can see? Yes. So, her clothes and everything, the entire body was green in color, the entire body top to bottom, she wore a green leaves uh, clothing and she wore jewels and even everything, crown, whatever she had worn from top to bottom, all those things are made of uh, vegetables and fruits. Vegetables and fruits. Smiling gently at Gundu, she said, I am Shakambari. Who am I? She said to him, she introduced herself to, yes, Gundu. I am Shakambari. She smiled gently means with a soft, uh, simple smile. She smiled and she said, I am Shakamri Devi, the goddess of gardens. Why do you look so upset? Why do you look so upset? What do you mean by upset? Upset means very sad. Why do you look so upset? Why are you looking so sad? My dear small little boy, what is the problem? Why are you looking very sad? You know who am I? I am Shakambari Devi. My name is Shakambari Devi and I am the goddess of this garden. I am the goddess of the garden. Gundu shared his problem with her. So immediately Gundu what he told him? He told all the problem. Whatever he is having, he explained to that Shakambari Devi. He told her, he told her everything. How everyone called him leather chick at school and at home. And how he had started feeling unwell. 
but did not know what was wrong. So he explained everything, how the teachers are scolding him, what the teachers are saying and even friends are saying at home, what is the problem he is facing. Every now and then he was getting the scoldings, what is the reason he didn't understand. But this was what the activity of mind from morning till evening he told. Why I became unwell also, I don't know all these things. Why I became so fat, all these things I don't know. And what was wrong with me, that also I don't know. She heard all of his grievances. Grievances. What is the word now? Grievances. Means like uh, you will be giving the complaints of one or one another, no? That we call it as grievance. Complaints. All the complaints, he, all the problems which he is having, he expressed it to this lady, Shakambari Devi. All, she heard all of his grievances patiently, means with lot of patience, she listened to all the things which Gundu was explaining and then said, let me introduce you to some of your friends, sorry, some of my friends, Gundu. They have helped my ch many children like you become strong and healthy. If you listen to them, definitely they will help you too. So here, okay. So Shakamari Devi, what is the problem of Gundu? She understood very clearly. Okay ma, okay Gundu, what is your problem? I understood very clearly. Now, what I will do is, I will introduce to, I will introduce you to my friends. I will introduce you to my friends. Friends. Why? Because these my friends, they help lots and lots of children. Like these type of problems. Whoever are having these type of problems with those problems, they are being helped. So if if I introduce them to you, if you if you listen to them, then definitely you will also get a solution. So saying Shakamari started walking towards the tomato patch with Gundu running to catch up with her. So Shakambari Devi, she was walking very fast and Gundu, he was so away, you know. So he was trying to follow her. So where the Shakambari Devi is taking him? She was taking him directly towards the tomato patch. She was taking to the tomato patch. Wherever more number of tomatoes are grown, that area we call it as tomato patch. She took Gundu to that tomato patch. And this Gundu was running, running, trying to catch her, trying to catch her, making, trying to equalize the walk with her. Because of his obesity, he was not able to walk very fast. Okay, children? This is clear, Rita? So, with my blessings, you will be able to hear these friends talk for some time. Come along, she said. So, what she said? When she reached to this tomatoes, while she was walking, while these two people are walking towards the tomato patch, she told like this, you can listen to the words of my friends. Because when the tomatoes or vegetables, if they speak, can we listen to their voice? Can we understand their voice? We cannot understand, isn't it? Like that, while they were speaking, what I will do is, for a few minutes, I will give you the power that you will be able to understand what they are speaking, will be able to understand everything and you can give the reply or whatever you want. So that's what for a few minutes I am giving you that power she said. Come along with me she said. She first walked him to a tomato patch. As he looked searching for Shakambari's friend, the cherry red tomato growing in patches greeted him excitedly. Hello Gundu. So okay. So she walked towards the tomato patch and she was finding some of the tomatoes because the tomatoes are still growing maybe. Okay, she was Shakambari Devi was searching for the reddish beautiful tomatoes. And as soon as the reddish tomatoes saw her, she's this tomato, she wished directly, Hi Gundu, how are you? They were speaking like this. Okay, with a very great excitement. Excitement means we can show on your face. Isn't it? That ex 
excitement with a smile or your expression gestures you can show the excitement and tomato is also showing like this here you can see the red color tomato the reddish tomato with a beautiful smile on his face it was a greeting good it was greeting gundu hi gundu i'm very excited to see you how are you after overcoming his pleasant shock at hearing the red tomatoes speak he heard them say we tomatoes are rich in vitamin a b and c if you have us you can avoid cold cough and many other problems the best part is you can eat us in curries salads and even in the form of juices we are delicious delicious means we are most tastiest delicious means tastiest delicious means tastiest tasty we are very tasty you know so gundu when tomato was speaking hi gundu she said no immediately for a few minutes for a few seconds gundu was shocked means whether he is in a dream or he was it was real he was not able to catch up so after a few seconds he realized that it was true that it was true really the tomato was speaking to him and what tomato said is here the tomato was speaking like this we tomatoes means all the tomatoes all the family of the tomatoes what they have they are rich in vitamin a b and c what are the vitamins you will have you will have vitamin a you will have vitamin b and you will have vitamin c you will have vitamin a b and c these three vitamins are rich rich means more in the tomatoes and if you consume us you can take this you can take the tomato in three forms like one is we can make curry we can add with any other curries isn't it only tomato also we can make curry or we can make dal dal means pakku tomato pakku this is the ma so tomato we can make curries we can make dal we can make uh, salad you know salad yeah right right raw we will eat we will cut the uh, tomatoes we will add some munching to that and we will eat the tomato and not only salads if you are more interested you can take us in the form of juice also you can even make us into juice you can take out the pulp and you can take the juice and you can have it if you whatever the way you eat we are very very delicious we are very very tasty okay you may have it out why should we eat tomatoes why should we take tomatoes what is the use of tomatoes you may ask a question like this then what it will protect you from is first thing is it protects you from cold you know cold the rompa cold cough 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 is nothing but the go now it is we are in that pandemic situation only that is we are suffering from covid 19 so due to seasonal changes also some people are suffering with cold and cough is it it uh if we are feeling with cold and cough we are what we are feeling we got covid we are scared about that that is not so if you take these type of supplements even uh, at present situation also if these problems should not come to you means you must take the tomato smoke okay children that is why so cold and cough it won't let you to come to you it protects you from cold and cough cold and cough and many other some different problems are all from any other problems also we can protect so every day at least not like every day it's not at least to be take twice or thrice if you take tomatoes you will get the vitamin a vitamin b vitamin c at present what are the uh, whenever you switch on the tv even in the news or even in the whatsapp wherever you go you can find but now it is people are asking you to consume vitamin a vitamin c am i right vitamin a vitamin c and vitamin d a c d these three are very very important d is not mostly not available in the foods mostly 
hardly in very less uh, foods. Hardly one or two foods in food items we will be having vitamin D. But even when we cook or when we boil, that little part also may be vanished. That's why in vitamin D is available only through the sunlight. Vitamin D is available only through the sunlight. That's why people are asking whenever you uh, a fresh, whenever you are having the sunlight, please stand at least for a half an hour in front in the sunlight. At present, it is not much sunny. It's just cloudy, and whenever you get the sun, at that time, also, please you please stand in front of the sun. Stand, stand wherever in the balcony or wherever you get the sunlight, please stand for at least half an hour so that you will get the vitamin D and you will be protected. So that is the main possibility. But whereas coming to the vitamin B, C, D, E, K, all these vitamins are available through the foods for us. Through the foods. And in that, tomato is one of the richest food item which is having three vitamins that is A, B and C. B, you know, B complex tablets we will be consuming. B complex tablets are so sorry. We feel very bitter taste we have. After uh, taking that also, even for a long time, we feel so uneasiness. But if you take the tomatoes, do we feel any uneasiness? No. That means we can, instead of taking the tablets, we can protect our health by taking the tomatoes because we are having three uh, rich uh, vitamins in there. In this way, we can protect ourselves. So, we can, we can protect ourselves from cold and calf. Okay, children? So, about the tomatoes, it is clear, no? So, in this, we came to know about lethargic, lacking of energy. Lethargic means, what do you mean by? Lethargic means, lacking of energy and enthusiasm. Your zeal is reducing. Your teachers are saying that day by day, you are, your energy levels are down and you are, he is not at all showing any interest. Interest towards any part of the work. And radiant means glowing brightly. Glowing brightly means uh, shining. Shining brightly. Upset means feeling very very sad. Grievances means complaints. Grievances means complaints. Going on giving complaints on one another. We call he had a lot of grievances on me. He had a number of grievances on me. You can write a own sentence like that. Means he is having a lot of grievances to on me means he is having a lot of complaints on me. Delicious means tasty. Most delicious means we can say like this tomatoes are the delicious food items or we can say like potato chips are the delicious food item. I love tomatoes because they are very delicious. You can write any of the sentence like that. Understood children? So I hope from today onwards at least weekly twice or thrice you consume uh, tomato at least after as, you, as soon as your father brings the tomatoes from outside please wash them thoroughly keep it under the tap and let the water to drain for 5 minutes or 2 minutes okay children then you take it cut it properly and you can even directly if you are not comfortable light sugar you can sprinkle on that or else you can take nimbu nimbu means lemon you can sprinkle okay you can squeeze this and you can eat directly the tomato like that. So, if you eat at least one tomato like that, you will get the vitamin A, B, C directly. And you will be protected this uh, dangerous uh, present situation uh, diseases like cold and cough. We get protect ourselves. Hope you understood till here. Okay, children. So, till this, whatever are there, the meanings and everything, please make a note and we will continue in the next class. See you.